It was a huge period of suck. I couldn't do anything right. In my tech support job, I just couldn't satisfy any of the customers. My boss was constantly on my case. What's the matter with you? Why can't you get this right? I would wake up each morning full of stress and fear from the nightmares of the night before. Talking to my therapist, I sobbed. I just want to be normal again. I quit my job and my friend needed some help taking care of his house in Pueblo. It seemed like a great opportunity for a change of scenery, so I moved. I thought it was only going to be here for a year or two. Back in San Diego, I had a friend who had given me a community garden plot as a birthday gift. It was wonderful, hard work in the outdoors, which I needed for my mental health. It was a great refuge from the dark place I was heading. Now in Pueblo, I was living in an apartment and really wanted to grow a garden. I was surprised I couldn't find a community garden here, so I asked the leadership of my new church if I could start one, and they readily agreed on the spot. Yes, we should do that. It would be a good way to connect with our community, and so I created the Miracle Community Garden. We easily got five gardeners on board with the project. I got our members to help build and a few local businesses to donate items or give us discounts. It was really amazing how the whole community came together and got involved. My pastor suggested I become a master gardener so that I could take on a leadership role and people would realize I know what I'm talking about when I'm teaching them how to grow food. We are now in our ninth year. When I walk into the garden, In the spring especially, I see the flowers are blooming and everything is green. People driving by stop to look and talk to me about the garden. I take a deep breath of fresh air and remind myself that, wow, I did this. This is my creation.